to CBS Mornings. I'm Gail King. Coming up in this hour, bright lights in the big city. We welcome you to our new home in Times Square. And I'm Tony DeCopel. Step aside, Nirvana and Pearl Jam. We'll introduce you to the unsung godmother of grunge music. I'm Nate Burleson. Singer Kim Petras reveals some of this year's performers at the VMAs only on CBS Mornings. Hey, what's up? Hey. But first, here's today's eye opener at 8. Average daily deaths from COVID are now the highest they've been since March. Experts are concerned that Labor Day travel could lead to new spikes. So 20 patients in the hospital, only one does not have COVID. Wow. That's how it's been. Past three weeks. Five men accused of involvement in 9-11 are due in military court today for the first time in a year and a half, including alleged mastermind Khalid Sheikh Mohammed. The hearing in Guantanamo Bay comes just days before we mark 20 years since the attack. President Biden travels north to see Ida's aftermath firsthand today. The storm was the deadliest hurricane to hit the U.S. in four years. The extensive damage has renewed our questions about our ability to protect ourselves against climate change. These storms are now more frequent. They're more intense. We desperately need that climate resiliency infrastructure. Welcome back. It's an historic day right here in our new studio in the middle of Times Square. I have to say, when I pulled up this morning, I've never been in Times Square at 5 a.m. Me neither. Where you can hear all sorts of conversations of people going around. But even at 5 a.m., it feels electric out. Gail, you never party till 5 a.m.? <laughs> no. Not in Times Square. Yeah, anyway. I'm a big square. No, I never have. It, it but was it just amazing. feels very different. It, it was like broad. It was like 12 noon. The lights are that bright. Yes. Yeah, it's like a jolt of uh, energy, like having coffee without the I caffeine. I think so, yeah. too. I'm, I'm really excited about this new chapter. For, for all of us. As you see, we've got a new home. We've got a new name, CBS Mornings. Make sure you, you reminded Tony last week people to change their DVR. Change your DVR. If you have the old name in there, it will not.